Hi, it's Kevin here from How to Blog with WordPress. And I'm here in the dashboard of that blog site. And this is a video that will explain why I use WordPress as my content management system. Okay, WordPress itself is not the only CMS system out there. There are um, some other well-known ones such as Joomla and Drupal and PHP Nuke. And they're all content management systems that share one thing in common. Uh, you can basically install one of these systems and run an entire website. No matter what that website is, you can run that entire website from a dashboard very like this one. Now this is WordPress. The other ones look slightly different, but they do the same thing. Now the reason I use WordPress is because WordPress is by far the most supported system of the ones I've mentioned. Joomla and Drupal are pretty well supported. Um, PHP New not so much anymore. But WordPress outstrips all of them by a factor of about a thousand. There are literally millions of themes. Now a theme is what you see when you go to the site as a visitor. This is the blog site, How to Blog with WordPress, Mastering the Fundamentals of WordPress. Now, this is the theme. This is showing, this is how you see the content. Okay, and this is where that content is created and posted from and how that blog entirely is controlled. Okay, uh, and you, these, these themes are so, they're so diverse. They can do so many things with them now that it's not even funny anymore. <laughs> it actually can be quite complex in some respects. But you can see there's not an awful lot here right now and I'm a little bit late getting this up. Um, it's been a bit of a busy time trying to get everything together. But that's beside the point. I use WordPress because it has huge functionality, huge diversity. Uh, and to give you some idea, um, I'm going to go and show you the the key elements of what made WordPress so powerful. Um, the first one is themes. The theme, like I said, is what you see when you visit the site as a visitor. And the themes, I have about 20 some odd loaded, I think. I've got 23 loaded. I'm using headlines. This is a, uh, a, a, a custom... Um, theme that I've purchased um, and there are a thousands of, of free ones available of course um, some of these are free uh, Aris theme for example this one here is free Carrington blog is free black and white is free I have some premium ones in here too um, and I'm trying to think what the premium ones are and I can't for the life of me see them just yet they may not be loaded here actually actually magazine is a theme that I paid for studio press um, and I think I've also got um, a couple of really, really super themes in the other page. Uh, Multiplex 4, which is the one on the left-hand side here. But you get the sort of idea. Um, and Socrates, of course, is a very powerful theme. Um, and I paid a lot of money for this. Um, I don't use it on this particular blog site, but you know, maybe on some other time I'll change it to that. And that's a good thing about it. With themes, you can change the look of your blog simply by activating the theme. You can preview it. And I'll show you what that looks like, um, in the terms of Socrates at least. Um, if you were to put that on, this is what that blog would look like. Uh, this blog would look like that. Um, and the functionality would be slightly different, because it wouldn't work the same. Um, there's some aspects that I want to see on the other blog site that aren't available in this theme. But they still function the same. So that's why I like the the, word, the WordPress itself, is because of the theme capability. Um, and themes are what you show the world. But the other side of it is the plugins. And I've got about 25 or 26 plugins right now that are currently active. And what these plugins do is provide functionality. And they customize the functionality. Um, so each of these plugins here... Um, RSS includes SEO friendly images, SEO presser, which is a paid plugin, uh, Sociable, which is a free, Tiny MC Advanced is a free, which is the um, where you type your posts. Uh, Web Traffic Genius Pro is a paid, Wishlist Member is a paid, uh, WordPress Database Backup is free, WordPress Drip is paid. Um, there's a combination of free and paid in here, and the, each of them provides. Um, a certain amount of functionality. And to give you some idea of how complex they can be, uh, let's just look at Wishlist Plugin. This is a membership site um, software plugin. Uh, it's going to take a second to load. Um, this is what it shows, and then you can see there's a 
a whole bunch of other stuff at the top here. Settings, how many members, membership levels, um, whether you can upgrade sequentially, email settings, membership content, you know, membership level adjustments. Um, and this is just one plugin. And then you've got other simple ones, uh, which are um, free. Uh, but you can download them if you like. Uh, all in one SEO pack is a free one. Uh, and this one is um, highly recommended. It actually sets up your blog as a search engine friendly right out of the box. Uh, you have to enable the plugin because when it first gets here, it's disabled. And it's best to give it a, um, a home title, which is an alternative to your own. And we'll get into all this when we get into how to configure your blog um, for the search engines using plugins like this. But this is this is the functionality that's available, and for the majority of it, it's free. So why wouldn't you use free software? And that's why WordPress, in my considered opinion, is perhaps um, the greatest piece of software that's ever been produced, mass-produced, that is available for um, the common man to use. That's why I use WordPress, and I highly recommend you do too. Um, this has been Kevin from How to Blog with WordPress.net. Uh, thanks for watching. Come back and watch some more videos uh, over the coming days, weeks, and months, uh, and discover how you can set up your own blog, start to finish. Um, you know, we're not going to talk about any fluff here. We're going to show you step by step, and sometimes there's more than one way. Some are quicker than others, um, and you'll find it all here. So come and have a look uh, at your own leisure. Thanks for watching. Bye bye now.